Hey guys, I've been promising you a new studio tour video for a long, long time now, and I can finally get round to it and announce also that I am officially a Logitech G ambassador, which means they've sent me some awesome new stuff out that I want to show you guys. Whilst this is going to be a studio tour, it's also going to be kind of like a, a showcase on how Logitech G's features, including LightSync, help me completely customize my setup and look exactly the way that I want it to look. A lot of you guys would have seen my Instagram posts. I've had a lot of compliments on my setup now with the Logitech LightSync that has actually taken it to a whole new level and I can show you how that benefits me, especially one thing that we'll touch on in a minute, the uh, the sense of immersion that you can get through using those, those uh, features. So uh, let's head out to the office. I'll show you guys what's going on and uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy the video. All right, let's head out to the office, guys. I gotta be quiet because Buzz's sleeping, so is Ovi. One minute. So yeah, for those of you who aren't aware, my office isn't actually in my house. My office is a separate building, which is just outside. So when you guys are wondering how Puzzle doesn't hear me, this separates us. This means that Puzzle gets plenty of rest with the baby when she needs it. And here we are. That's how far I have to walk to work in the morning. Okay, so once we're inside, we've got this other door here. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and switch to my gaming microphone for the rest of this voiceover because as you guys can tell, the phone camera is not all that great. So there it is, guys. That's uh, years in the process of setting that up there. Um, thank you to everybody who's made this possible. Thank you to everybody who has helped me get the setup. You guys may have seen, actually, I did a, um, uh, I tweeted out the other day, a picture of how my setup used to look compared to how my setup looks now. And the difference is just night and day. I, I cannot thank you guys enough for all your support uh, that you give, meaning that I get to come and sit in here and stare at that every day. Um, apologies for the low light image quality, by the way. That, um, that's something that I didn't actually anticipate when I came to film this. Uh, I'm gonna give you guys a much better example of how Logitech's LightSync software works later on in the video. Towards the end, we'll go and, uh, we'll go and take a look at some of Logitech videos so I can give you a better description of that. Anyway, let's go and take a look and see what Logitech gave us, shall we? This is the brand new stream cam from Logitech. It does 1080p of 60fps video, and it does that in landscape and portrait. And as you can see there, I was a little eager to get that one open. Up next, we have the Logitech G915 Lightspeed. That's fully a wireless keyboard, or you can choose wired if you prefer. It's RGB with Logitech's LightSync technology again. Once again, later on in the stream... Oh, yep. Sorry about that, guys. Beep boop. So yeah, later on in the stream, we'll touch again on that light sync technology and how all your well, light sync devices can work together in unison. Uh, up next is the G840 mouse mat, extra large mouse mat there. And finally, the thing I'm probably most excited about, and I cannot wait to show you guys just all of the features of this, is the G560. As you can see, once again, all of those products there come with the G with the light sync technology. Uh, we'll touch up on this a little bit later on. Uh, the, de the picture on the back here is basically demonstrating how you can use screen capture to capture an area of the screen as demonstrated by my beautiful camera work. Uh, and then use the speakers there, the G560 speakers, to actually help you with immersion into the game. And on the back of the box here, we've got saying about the 240 watts total output of these speakers. A really nice sound from these speakers, if I do say so. And again, advertising that light sync technology, which will be a key feature of this video. Let's go ahead and take a look at a Logitech promotional video showing off exactly what the G560s can do. The Logitech G560 boasts 16.8 million colors, all programmable and customizable in the Logitech G Hub software. You can link together any Logitech LightSync product for a fully customized, unique experience tailored to you. A huge number of games and applications work in conjunction with LightSync technology, and after using it myself, I can honestly say it's a feature that I never really cared for before. RGB was never really something that I was interested in, but this adds a level of immersion that I never expected to get from a set of speakers. The software itself, G-Hub, is really easy to use, shown here with screen grab. Let's say you want to get an area of the screen to cast the color onto your wall. You literally just drag a square, click the box, and there you go. It really is that simple. You guys know how bad I am with technology, and even I can do it. Let's say you just want to chill and listen to music. LightSync also works with music as well. The uh, pulse setting, for example, is really, really nice, demonstrated here. It creates a very, very nice ambiance. That's right, I know posh words as well. Here we have my man shelves. Everybody has a man drawer, right? Uh, many of you will notice things that you've sent me on there. Thank you guys so much for all that. 
uh, presents from Puzzle there, some vape juice. Uh, working my way down, this is my old Logitech keyboard, which I'm no longer using, but it's still my spare. I got my G502 and my headset box there because I don't like throwing anything away. And just on the shelves to the left of that, we have a few more things. Of course, that helmet that New Sumo sent me, absolutely awesome. And my old Logitechs, the C920 and the C922. And now to look at the desk. As you can see, pretty much all of my peripherals there are wireless or Logitech as well. Uh, the only couple of wires I've got really are the Stream Deck and of course the audio mixer, which I'm looking at getting a new one, but hey, that's not gonna do anything about the wires, right? Um, that keyboard there, the Logitech G915, we're going to go and have a little look at another Logitech video and I'm going to talk you guys through some of the awesome features that it has and how that helps streamers. The thing that I've loved about this keyboard ever since I first got it is just the design is absolutely beautiful. It's very low profile. The tactile switches are really, really nice. They've got just enough bounce back. They've got hardly any of that click. And I've noticed uh, quite a few people in the stream recently have actually been saying how much quieter my keyboard sounds. Uh, that's thanks to those tactile keys. Across the top there, you could just see that we've got a button that has like a little joystick on it. That button is actually really, really handy. If you're a streamer like me and you're an idiot and you keep pressing the Windows key or if there's a key that you don't want to press, what you can do is you can enable that and then you can select through the G-Hub software to disable those keys. So let's say you don't want to hit that Windows key while you're in game. You can just select that in G-Hub software and disable it. Another really cool feature, which hasn't I have not really seen touched upon before, but I found this very useful, is the ability to connect this keyboard to two PCs simultaneously. As a streamer with two rigs, I find that really, really helpful. Uh, I'm just moving away from using a second keyboard now and trying to get the hang of it, but by connecting a wireless Bluetooth dongle to my streaming rig and connecting the dongle for the G915 Lightspeed to my gaming rig, I'm actually able to just press a button and switch between the two simultaneously. Now, if you're the kind of streamer who is doing a lot of giveaways or you need to get to your bot command, if you need to perhaps you need to time somebody out because you don't have a mod and you need to get onto your second PC, that that tool for me personally is an absolute winner with this keyboard uh and yeah guys that's it that's my uh that's my studio that's um i hope that's given you a little bit of insight into how these new logitech products that i have may help you uh help you as a streamer help you as a gamer help you to get the full level of immersion that you want out of your games um i thought i'd just finish up this video by showing you guys from this perspective from the webcam looking out so you can see everything that we saw in the office here as i said earlier absolute mess in that corner i know don't worry i'm going to clean that up uh the shelf here that i showed you at the start of the video if there's anybody who recognizes anything they've bought on there because a lot of you guys have contributed to that shelf thank you so much please feel free to leave a comment below if you notice something that you bought um yeah guys for those that uh for those that are unsure of how my green screen works by the way we've got ourselves a pull up elgato green screen here it's um it can get kind of annoying having the uh, the green screen in the middle of the room like that, but to be honest with you, if I ever need to, to work in here, I just kind of push it out the way, and then it's got markers to show me where to put it back anyway, so... Yeah, that's not a problem. Um, anybody who wants a little bit more of an in-depth description into what specs I have for my PCs, please feel free to head over to beardageddon.com where you can see my full list of specs, including various uh, snapshots we've got there of them. And just once again, a big thank you to the guys at VexGG for hooking me up with this and the guys, of course, at Logitech for sending out all the new products. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you have, please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you, guys.